Hi everyone, I am B. Vijay Krishna, assistant professor in the Department of Mechanical Engineering, Institute of Aeronautical Engineering. Now we will discuss about the blacksmithy. Blacksmithy is a trade in which a metal is uh, heated to the molten temperature and made operations on that one to get the desired product. Now we will discuss uh, this uh, blacksmithy in detail. Okay, in blacksmithy what we will do? We will take a round rod, a round rod is taken and we will make the required shapes from this rod, okay. In, in our, uh, uh, what we call for blacksmithy, we have a two trades, uh, two experiments called J, J shape and S shape. Two experiments are there, J shape and S shape. Initially, we will do the J shape. Okay. Before going to do the experiment, let like we will see the what are the tools used in the blacksmithy. Okay. This this one we will call as a tong, which is used to hold the hot objects. Okay. The tongs will be there, and this is a flatter upon which the hot rod we will place, and we will apply the load on it with the help of Metal Okay. As usual, steel wheel is used for measuring purpose, and this one is used for cutting purpose. Okay. Now, initially, we will do the first experiment called as the J shape. Okay. Then take take the longer raw material rod and cut it according to the whatever our given dimensions are there. Okay. This is 150 mm length. To make the J shape, we have to make 150 mm length. Nothing but this is suppose 300, 400 rod length is there. We have to mark the 150 mm with the help of measuring scale. Okay. Then mark, do the marking over here and cut according to this. This rod in this stage, it will not be what we call folded or bended. Okay, to bend this one in order to get the J shape, we need to bend the straight rod from here. Okay, in order to bend that one, we have to heat the material, raw material into the furnace. Okay, now we will go to the furnace. This is an ele electric furnace with the capacity of 900 degrees centigrade. You can heat the any workpiece up to 900 degrees centigrade. We have to heat this rod up to the red hot temperatures. Now we can see the furnace over here. Some two rods are already there, which is used for heating purpose. Okay, now take the one rod which is used for making J purpose from the supplement. Okay, right. Now take that one to the anvil. This one we will call as an anvil. Keep in the hole and with the help of tongue you have you have to bend it in a J shape. Simply you have to keep in the hole and you have to bend it according to the J shape. Use the flatter for getting flat purpose at the corner. Okay. Now you can see J shape over there. Flatter is used to flatten the surface. Right, hold the thumb. This is your J shape which is made from straight rod. The rod is kept in the furnace to the red hot temperature, simply brought into the anvil and kept in the hole and simply we have bended that one. We got the required gesture. Okay. Now we will go for a second experiment called as S shape. Okay. Similarly, we will take one another rod from the uh, earth furnace. We will take another rod from the earth furnace. Okay, that is a heated rod, heated up to 900 degrees centigrade. Now we will bring same to the anvil. <coughs> okay. 
J shape is done in one step, but S will be done in two steps. Same way you have to bend it like how you are done in the J shape. One side is over, another side. You have to do this process faster because if the rod get uh, water will cool, it, then it will not bend. Okay, same bending both the side. If you bend, you will get the action. Right. <coughs> With the help of flat hand, you have to flat hand the half hand. Now, <coughs> we got the required S shape. Now, you can see that one. Do not hold these objects with the bare hands, it will be harder. Right. This is about the blacksmithy. Like, share and subscribe. Hit the bell icon for more updates.